Hello everyone, welcome back to Deus Ex. Alright, I'm in Hong Kong now, it's time to find Tracer Tong. Apparently the way to do that is to look for clues at the compound that Paul used to visit to the east of the Wan Chai Market. But I'm not going to worry about that for now. For now I'm just going to take in this place, talk to people, see what's around here, just see what's going on. Let's get a feel for the place. I'm assuming this is the Wan Chai Market, because it does look like a market. Hmm. Anybody in there? Oh, yes. Okay. So I could hack my way in there, but that guy would see me. There's a delicious little data cube sitting on the table. Hmm. I'll leave that for now. Ooh. There's a lot of stuff in there. Oh, <gasps> kitty cat! Damn it, I crouched too low. I can't get a good view of it. Hi. There's a dog in there, too. Oh, God. Hi. Hey, buddy. I kind of want to pet this thing. It's kind of cute when it's not shooting at me with a minigun. Oh god, can I pick these up? What would she think if I just picked up all of her... all of her wares and just threw them about? Hmm. Hand penned china. Very authentic. Authentic, you say? Alright, let's examine a piece. Hmm. Not bad. Not bad. But this was not hand painted! Okay, I've had my fun here. Actually, no, I'm not done yet. Now I'm done. I wish I could read these signs. This one says newsstand, obviously, but most of these don't have any English words. Everybody in Chai Market. I have made other arrangements. I never fall asleep. I am one of the best watchmen. Run along. I don't work with the boys. This is a bad market. Lots of bad people. Go! The only... The only thing worse than the people in this market is this kid's voice acting. Two? Yes, a little something to brighten up the lab. Versa life? How can you tell? Is my hair turning blue? Mm hmm? Versa life has done much to revitalize the community. Well, they're always hiring. I guess that's something. I will wrap them up. No, no. I can manage. Very good. Thank you. <laughs> you know, I heard that, uh, I heard that Please, one of the... Please, look around. I heard that one of the strong points of the Deus Ex series was not voice acting. That is certainly true. Alright, somewhere around here. This kid, though... This kid looks like... She said no. Impossible. She said she has made other arrangements. The Red Otto? She was very rude. You know what to do. Yes, sir. Don't waste any time. What the hell is going on? Okay, I'm gonna keep following this kid. But I'd just like to point out that this kid is extremely creepy looking, and he looks like a full-grown man. Like the model of a full-grown man that's simply been scaled down. And he also walks like a robot. Go away! <laughs> what is this kid up to? Triad leader is what that just says. This is the triad compound. Okay. Alright, let's see what this little shit's up to. And apparently that woman's from the first life compound building Perhaps whatever a for your girlfriend? so I should probably talk to 
Peggy in a minute. Alright. What? Huh? Give what back? He, he just stood out in... Uh, what? <laughs> what did he just steal? Only 20 credits. I can tell them you're a spy and they will kill you. I don't think anybody can take you seriously, kid. Not with a voice like that. This is weird. God, I love this music so much though, isn't it awesome? Okay, it's kind of hard to sing and I didn't hum it very well, but it's seriously awesome. Groovy. I did it. I did it. Did anybody see? Yeah, I think so. It doesn't matter. We got her payment plus interest. Get back and see if she runs something. Okay. Oh my god. Oh, Jesus. He's got to go back again. Okay. I'm going to go ahead of him and just talk to some people while I wait for a slow ass to walk here. Hey, Peggy. Such a quaint little market. A lovely bouquet of orchids symbolizing grace and integrity. <laughs> that voice acting. That voice acting so bad. <laughs> Only 20 credits for that one. Please, look around. It sounds like they just, like, took someone in, like, off the streets. Like, they would, like, oh, we need a voice actor for this part. And then somebody walked out in the street and said, Hey, you, do you want a voice act? I'll pay 50 bucks. She's Please, like, look sure. Around. Went into the studio and then just, like, bumbled over the text. A lovely bouquet of orchids. Symbolizing grace and integrity. <laughs> I told you, bad people around here. Get out of here. Go. I am your new watchman. You stole a hundred credits from me. The dragon head said I am your watchman. 50 credits every day. That's better than a hundred. I can make a profit as it is. I will do a good job. Is he... What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what is happening? Is he going back again? What is he going to say? I... Uh... I don't even know what's happening anymore. I know the dragon head. Okay, thank God he's not going back. All right, we're done with that. A lovely bouquet of orchids, symbolizing grace and integrity. Okay, well I'd love to buy a bucket, a, a bucket of orchids, but apparently they're free. Thank you. I guess I get a discount for being awesome. All right, putting those there might have been a bad idea. All right. News of Trier Wars. Red Arrow versus its ruminous path. You know, I'm not sure if these accents are, like, downright offensive or if they're just bad. I don't know. I can't tell. Wait, there's two different kinds of triads? Hmm. That's getting complicated. All right, what about the Luminous Path? What do you think of the Luminous Path, Triad? Cowards, soon to be gone. They have to steal weapons because they have lost the traditional arts. What kind of weapons? They murdered the Red Arrow leader to get the sword he invented. How do you invent a sword? It uses modern technology. I pay the Red Arrow even though the Luminous Path compound is 50 meters away. Invented a sword? It wasn't the Dai Katana by any chance, was it? Many publications. What do you think of the Red Arrow Triad? They will control all of Wen Chai in a few weeks. You sound certain. The fighting is not going well for the Luminous Path. Well, maybe if I help the Luminous Path, it'll be a good fight for the other Triad, and the two Triads will cancel each other out. Yes, it's brilliant. Mass driver accident kills over 2,000. Holy shit! How do you kill 2,000 people with a car? 
Okay. The historical first delivery of ore from the... I, I don't know, Zhao Inlay Lunar Mining Complex ended in tragedy today when a targeting error resulted in the payload slamming into the outskirts of the city of I Ibadan in Nigeria. Thousands died in the initial blast that was compared to a small nuclear bomb as the payload impacted in a sparsely populated suburb. While thousands more were left disoriented, homeless, and without power or water in the wake of the explosion. Chinese officials have halted all other deliveries from the Zhao Inlay complex and are working with both the United Nations and officials from McMoran Global Steel to determine the cause of the error. McMoran Global Steel was responsible for the construction of the mass driver, winning the contract from Page Industries in a heated bidding war. Obviously, we took the utmost precautions in building the Zhao Inlay driver, said spokesperson Sean Murphy, but something has gone terribly wrong. Our only real response at this point is to offer our condolences and aid to the people of Ibadan and ensure that such an event never occurs again. Jacob's Shadow by Andrew Hammond, Chapter 20. Hmm. Samuel looked at him from across the table, but he might as well have been peering at Jacob from the Devil's Own Palace in the Deep Blue Sea. After a moment, Samuel rubbed his roomy eyes. You ever wonder about morals? He said. Jacob shook his head. I do. All the damn time. I wonder what it means to be good. If there's some tally that says, you only heard ten people, so come on up but 11 and you're going straight to hell. Then, I think, maybe it's a little voice that tells you, way back in your head. And then I wonder what happens when that voice goes away. Jacob reached under the table and put the little 22 pistol against one of Samuel's kneecaps. I don't think you're gonna like my answer to that. Where is she? Oh, I was just getting good. I want the rest of it. I'll come back for the other newspapers later. Welcome to Wanchai. Please use the following map. Okay, cool. Anything else useful in there? Okay. Mm -hmm. Alright, just a list of some other places that are here, but I'm sure I'll discover them for myself. Okay, let's take a look at it. Oh, wonderful. Thank you. Okay, so in other words, the only thing this map's actually good for is just showing me what major locations exist, because I sure as hell can't use this to figure out where I am. Let's see if I can find out what this place is called. Nope. I don't even know if that's on the map. Whatever, I'm just gonna keep exploring. No offense, sir, but what are you actually guarding? You realize nobody's gonna come in here, right? Because this isn't even how you get up here? Weird. Shopkeepers are honest. You will find a good bargain here. Let's go upstairs. Let's go get some tea. You want to do business at Wang Chai? We already have an arrangement with the Luminous Path. Do you want to do business in Wang Chai? I will not be threatened. Don't think your Luminous Path can protect you. Get out, now! As you wish, but don't be surprised if you don't pass your next inspection. I know people on the health board. They can't be bought. Perhaps, but they're dislike rats. I think we're gonna need to help oh the locals my God. out. They are everywhere. We will be patient while they clean up the mess. You can't be serious. We would offend Manabu if we were to leave so soon. Oh my god. Wait, where did those rats come from? I mean, that guy just said they don't like rats. Did he literally mean rats? Did, did he spawn rats or were they always here? Either way, ew. It's okay, JC Denton is here. Rat exterminator extraordinaire. Come here, you little shit. Two more to go. One more. Got him. You're welcome. Uh, you're gonna have to pay the cleaning bill, though. I'm sorry. I've done my part. 
We head to Jiao Si. Very good. I can't stand it. I've got to get out here. They will kill the rats. Not a problem. The rats are already dead. What are you talking about? Disgusting. Welcome to the lunch IT house. Anything you like? Twelve credits. What do you think of the triads? Don't talk to me about the triads. They give you a lot of trouble. They are punks. Talking all the time about community and traditions, then they fight over technology from a multinational corporation like VersaLife. How do you know that the sword came from VersaLife? It has nanotech components. It is self-sharpening or something. I wish they would use it to chop off each other's heads. <laughs> Maybe I can make that happen. I wonder if I can eradicate the triads. Are those flies? Oh god, now- oh wow, so there's dead rats all over the floor and flies. <laughs> yep, uh, business is gonna be a bit hurt. Explain. A disturbance in the tea house. Can you overlook? 100. No injuries, only a prank. 100. I have 55. 100. 65. Okay, 65. <laughs> Just imagining that guy's script. 100. 100. 100. Okay, 65. Hey, buddy. My own business. Fine. He'll get his comeuppance. You have not washed your hands. I'm just looking. Whoa, cool. What is she wearing? Cassandra. Watch where you're going. I didn't bump into you. But damn, her clothes are really cool. Neat face paint, too. Take a hike. I don't feel like taking a hike. My feet are sore. Hold on a second, sir. I'm just gonna beat your meat. Alright, meat has been beaten. Many fine restaurants buy the meats from me. Have you visited the Lucky Money, for instance? It's below the market in the mall. Lucky Money. The Lucky Money Club is in a mall beneath the market. The truck has stopped delivering to the other shops because of military pockets, but all of my meat is guaranteed fresh. Fresh lamb, fresh beef, brought in by Sampan. I don't know who or what that is, but I'll trust you. I'm sure it's the best meat in the market. Hmm. It seems like an elevator of some sort. Doesn't it? Alright, I still do want to hack in there. Don't think I can do anything there. I've been warned about you. Fine, I go somewhere else. Jeez, nobody likes Cassandra. Oh, that goes to the Lucky Money Club. I kind of want to follow Cassandra. Let's see where she goes next. Is she going back to the meat? The meat dude? <laughs> I'm just looking. I, I don't know if there's a story that has to do with her or a quest or something. There probably is at some point. Stay out of my way. Let's go to the Lucky Money Club. Trying to read that C C odd market. Oh, is that a C? Oh, I think that's a C. Second is second, or that's not an N. What? Ah, whatever. Need to recharge my batteries. Literally. Hmm. What's back here? Oh, is that a gondola? There's... There's nobody in it. It's a ghost boat. 
That's creepy. Alright, let's not overcomplicate things. That looks freaking huge. I'm gonna go back to... Uh, should I want to go to the Lucky Money Compound? Or Lucky Money Club? Or do I want to go to the place for the main quest? Hmm. I'll check down here. Oh, this goes to Versalife? Cool, I think I'm actually gonna be going to Versalife. Okay, that looks quite large too. Let's just go to the compound. One of the triadi places. Such a quaint little market. Hey, you little shit. Go away. You no, know, it doesn't even look like there's glass in these slits. I should be able to just reach in and grab the data cube. Well, there's no way. I mean, well, I suppose I could distract him with like a flare. Do I have a flare? I do have flares. I could maybe distract him with a flare. I want that data cube. I'm gonna do it. Make sure that little shit isn't looking. I'm sure it'll sell me up the river for a lollipop. What's in here? Hmm. Oh shit. I mean, they are sh they are shown as green, but I wonder if they turn red if they saw me. Where does this actually go? Doesn't seem terribly useful. No, this doesn't go anywhere. Let's try this. Distraction time. Okay then, that didn't work. Hi. Right. Ow. Okay, so since he's not on like alert mode, yet he doesn't even respond to distractions. In other words, it appears there's literally no way for me to get that at the moment, unless I had an invisibility suit, which would be seemingly a massive waste of it, not to mention I don't even have one. Unless I can reach it. I can't. Nope. Okay, forget it. Alright, so what is where and where is what? Old China hand? What else down here? Nah, that's probably a level transition. Don't know what that means. This place is huge. I'm so gonna get lost. Pigeons! Coo coo coo! Canal Road. Some ob obnoxious loud ass helicopter. Okay, I think it's time to go inside. I don't see anything around the parameter.
So, two places. Looks like that's the main compound. And this is... This might be like a temple, actually. I don't think this is... Yeah, I'm probably allowed to enter, I think. Yeah, it's a temple. Incense burner. And pigeons inside of here, too, which is kind of weird. This place looks kind of nice. I think I might suffocate from all the incense, though. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this would be pretty terrible for your lungs. Okay, is there a secret entrance? I was thinking maybe there's like something beneath it or something. There's gotta be something secret in here, but no. All right, there's enough. There's enough incense in here. There we go. I just totally defiled their temple. Oh my god, I'm a dick. Other Buddhas in Hong Kong. There's nothing in here, is there? Nope. Right, so... How do I get in? My brother's name is Paul Denton. I heard that he was a frequent visitor to this compound. Do you know him? The Romanos path is close to Guaylos. Paul was no friend of the West. My name is Gordon Quick. I know your brother, but you are not him. They say you are royal to Unatko. I was before Paul showed up in New York. A day later, I was helping the NSF. You want me to take your word? You are in Hong Kong now, and we are businessmen. Paul earned our trust by working with us. I don't have time for games. No games. We would like another ally like Paul. The tryouts are at war, thanks to a woman named Maggie Chow. A sword was stolen from the Red Arrow Triad, and Miss Chow started the war by blaming us the Romanus path. Why is one sword so important? It is an extraordinary sword called the Dragon's Tooth. Nanotechnology developed by the Red Arrows for Morida before he was murdered. We know that Chao is a liar, but we have no proof. I'll go speak to her, but first I need to find a man called Tracer Tong. I need his help. Mr. Tong deals with businessmen, not beggars or strangers who might be spies. Chow lives at 1313 Tonochi Road. Be observant. Find and examine that sword. It is the evidence we need. I'll help you against Miss Chow, but then I'll need to see Tong, or I won't be your ally for more than about 12 hours. Okay, 131 Tonochi Road. Find and examine the Dragon's Tooth Sword. Take a look at the map. Canal Road, Versa Life, Underworld Nightclub. Tanachi Road is great for shopping. Okay. Canal system offers fast travel. Good to know. <laughs> Visit the Joss Temple, a national treasure. <laughs> a national treasure that is now missing some of its treasures. Sorry. Also, it appears to be infested with pigeons. All right, well, I gotta go somewhere. Old China Hand, yeah, why not? Let's go here. I don't wanna go straight to the main quest. I wanna see what's around. Taking the sights. That was a delayed door opening sound. It's like the door just remembered a couple seconds after, like, oh, oh you're right, I'm a door. Squeak. Hmm. This thing doesn't seem to work. I'm disappointed. Hello? Wait, you can just go into the kitchen and it's unlocked? Okay, cool. What stuff can I steal? 
Lots and lots of drinks. I have no need of that inventory clutter, though. Are those dead pigeons? That's kind of gross. <laughs> There's lab flasks in the kitchen? What kind of experiments are they doing on food? Hello? Why am I sliding on the ground? Look at this. It's like it's icy. I'm getting a creepy vibe here. I mean, this is supposed to be a bar, right? I was expecting music and people, but it seems like everybody's dead. And the kitchen is creepy, and it's filled with lab flasks and dead pigeons. What the fuck is going on? I feel like I'm gonna find something horrible. Also, I'm gonna drink these, because I just realized I'm hurt. Keep one as a bribe. Huh? I mean, this I could see it's frozen. I could see sliding on that, but this doesn't have anything on the ground. Oh, well, probably just a visual glitch. I feel like there might be something up there. Let's find out. Hmm? Aha! Vents. My favorite thing. This is where the vent leads? Jesus. It's a weird construction. It's leading me somewhere completely different. That or this place is just very large. Maintenance. Oh my. Oh my. Okay. Interesting. <clears throat> I don't have much air at all. I don't Oh, I think it's a rebreather. Oh shit, go up. Go up. 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 <laughs> oh. Okay, do I have a rebreather on me? I feel like I did at some point, but I think I might have lost it. What does it look like? I don't think I have it. Oh no, yeah, here it is. <laughs> I don't think it's gonna last very long, though. Okay. Let's go ahead and save it. Well, there's another one there, so I gotta go grab it, too. Fuck, how do I get in there? Shit. Is there no way in there? Oh, I got it. Come on. Come on. Okay, got them both. Excellent. Was this creepy? Where the hell am I? Also, everything is flashing and trying to give me a seizure. I don't know why. Dear God, make it stop. That car seems altogether too small.
Oh god, what the fuck? Okay, those are not nice. Faster, faster. Why am I going so slow? I feel like I should be able to swim faster. Oh, that's part of my swim skill, isn't it? Okay, hold on. Hold on. How much does it cost to increase my swimming? Speed and lung capacity increase. Do I really want to get this just for this one section? I really don't. I really want to get lock picking. Oh shit. Hi. Can I shoot underwater? We're about to find out. Oh god, I can't. Well. Okay, what do I have that'll work underwater? Do I have anything? I have darts. Uh, that'll probably work underwater. I've got a lot of normal darts, too, which I never normally use, so that's fine. Let's find out. Okay, that does work. Cool. This seemed easier last time. Oh, this is fucking infuriating. Is there an easy way to get in there that I'm missing? I don't believe so, not unless I can bash these pipes open. Nope. Okay, one. I'm gonna use- alright, there we go. Let's save it. Almost used up one whole rebreather. Just getting another one. Scared it off. Also, why is everything so blue? And how come my light doesn't seem to be working right? Okay. Whew. Jesus Christ, light, come on. The fuck? I can't see anything. I'm pointing a light at the car in front of me and I can't fucking see it. Jesus. Oh my god. Maybe there's something in the car, maybe there isn't, I have no idea. But I do know that's not going anywhere. Use all of my rebreathers just flailing about. Is there anything down here? Hmm. Laser. Ammo. That was absolutely not even remotely worth it. You know, I remember hearing that people put points into swimming. It seemed to be a joke, like, people kept joking about putting points into swimming. I, I don't know if they were serious or not, but I could certainly see why someone would want to, because this is maddening. Between the slow swimming speed... Oh god. 
Between the slow I think I'm gonna die. Between the slow swimming speed and the seizure-inducing flashing of the lights, not to mention the fact that my own flashlight seems to barely function, is maddening. Yeah, I think I'm dead. I'm actually okay with that. Hold on, JC. You're fine, JC. Oh fuck, that's right. I know it was running away, but I just want to make sure I don't face it again. Oh. Who are you? Wow, an AUG upgrade. I just need a good AUG to actually use it on. A book. God's got a funny sense of humor sometimes. I'm writing this on the back of an issue of Tomorrow's Scientist. Hundley sent me to pick up a batch of Karkian eggs fresh off the plane. Couldn't trust anyone else. Wait, couldn't trust, couldn't trust anyone else, Dr. Fang. That's what he said. Big job. On the way back through the tunnel, everything just fell apart. Flash of light and noise, and suddenly I'm lying here. My legs are broken. It was probably a triad attack. They've been fighting lately. I thought emergency services would arrive, but no one's come. There's no internal bleeding that I can tell. I started to hear noises a while ago. I think the suspension crate in the car broke open, and the eggs are hatching. I can't reach anyone on my phone. It's been eight hours. I slept a little. I can hear the baby Karkians. Cries of hunger, precursor to infant food, seeking behavior. The irony is that this is the perfect environment for them. I saw a shadow of one a little while ago. My rough guess is that they're developing almost 20% more quickly than expected. Some nasty noises earlier. Several of the Karkians picking out the weakest of the litter and tearing it to pieces. I wish someone would come. Damn, this is really cool. This game is awesome. Also, I'm sorry that you died, but also, this is really cool. <laughs> finding in this collapsed, uh, finding this collapsed tunnel here. Like a science experiment gone wrong. Just so neat. Uh, can I get out of here? Can, can, I, can I leave? I can't jump. I can't uncrouch either. Okay, there we go. Holy fuck. Why is my oxygen going down that fast? That seems even faster than normal. I can't. I can't make it out. I can't make it out. I, I don't think. I'm out of rebreathers. Here we go. There's, there's no way I'm gonna make it out. Do I even have any medkits? to die. <sighs> okay, well, there's not really that much down there. There's something interesting, but it's not something I actually need, so I'm just not gonna go down there. 
I can see why people put points into swimming. Time for the slip and slide. Oh god. Yeah, I don't like the water. I'm getting out of here. Nope. There are people here, okay. Hold on, buddy. Let me save first before you come up to me. Paul Denton, I have the blueprints. I must warn you, I... Oh. Warn me about what? I have made a mistake. Paul's my brother. What's the problem? No, I have made a mistake. Hmm? No, I am sorry. I must say nothing. They would kill me. It's strange. I guess I, lo I look a lot like my brother. I wonder if that goes anywhere. If I can get the information from him at some point. I take care of you. Spatial price. <laughs> <laughs> that voice acting. <laughs> and her name is just Horror. Okay, then. What? I'm looking for someone called Tracer Tong. Heard the name? I know you. I know who you are. Yeah? You work for the Luminous Path. You should be dead now. Mm, but you left Hong Kong just in time. You have me confused with someone else. No, it was you. Miss Chow told us. You are the American who helped them steal the soul. Really, I... You cannot stop the Red Arrow. They will control China as they control Hong Kong. Very soon. So it's my brother that stole the sword? Hm. Many bargains at old China hand. Everything eight credits. <laughs> oh, the voice acting. You know of a Maggie Chow? Maggie Chow, a bad character. Before she was an actress. Now she's everywhere in Hong Kong politics. They say that she's a spy. Who does she spy for? No one knows. Somebody paid her a lot of money once. And one of the rare heirs ended up floating in a canal. Dangerous to talk about. So, some of this vo voice acting is indescribably bad. It, it's so bad. You buy in Wen Chai, you pay 12. Here, eight. Heard the name Tracer Tong? Tong, yes. Friend of a Luminous Path Triad. And by extension, enemy of the Red Air. What's his reputation uh, among the locals? Sure, by fear. Very well connected. You want to buy? Biomechanical augmentation? Just curious. Is there a lot of crime in Hong Kong? Much more than before, yes. Not very easy for the smugglers. What kind of smugglers? Slaves, heroin, biotech. Is there really a slave trade? Oh, sure. There's a lucky money underneath Wen Chai, the Red Air headquarters. Of their girls, they are kidnapped in Thailand or the Philippines. Not a pretty business. Oh, I'm going to have to do some freeing of some slaves then. That should be fun. What sort of biotech smuggling goes on? Mostly versus life, the golden triangle of biotech. Why would a multinational corporation smuggle their products on sampans? Import restrictions in many places. The United States, European countries. On what? Certain genetic advances, laboratory organisms, also tiny computers in your tissue. What's VersaLife trying to develop? Everything, the second man. The what? The second men? English author, Olaf Stepton. You have not read? Afraid not. Last in the first man, history of 19 species of human beings. I can't believe you do not know this book. 
I'm not big into books. Never mind. And I ran down my flashlight. Wonderful. I wouldn't need to use my flashlight so much if it wasn't for the fact that everything is so freaking dark. I just stole a drink. He didn't notice. Oh my god, this place is a maze. It seems suspicious that that was there, but there's got to be something inside of it. Binoculars. Not exactly something I need, though. <laughs> hmm, there's one of those gunshot sensor things. Is that Cassandra? No, that's someone else. Alright, looks like I'm in the right area. I bet you come from the market. That's where I want to go. Schoolgirl. She seems quite old to be a schoolgirl. You are an unfamiliar face on Tonochi Road. I'm here on business from Gordon Quick. You are here to speak to Miss Chow, perhaps. Half a block down on the left. Thank you. The woman is a snake. Believe nothing she says. All right. Let's take a look around first. My mother said there's too much fighting. I have to stay here. Luxury suites. Queen's Tower. Ooh. This place looks fancy. Holy crap. Hi. You missed them. They left over an hour ago. I, what? Who? I'm looking for a way into this building. Use front of building. Only try out use sidewall living back. Good advice. Four picks. That's a lot of picks. That's why I want to upgrade my lockpick skill. Maggie Chow wants to see me. I assume that's her hotel across the street? That is correct. How do I get up to see her? The main elevator. Maggie Chow would be angry if you arrived any other way. Honestly, I'm not too worried about pissing her off. Plus... Where the hell is this girl? So it's like I was saying she's a snake, I kind of want to see if I can, like, hack her computer and get information about her before I actually speak to her. What is this place for? Hmm. Alright. That's the back. What's down here? Not advisable for tourists to visit the canals at night. <laughs> I think I can handle myself. 
I've only got an entire armory strapped to my back. Not to mention I'm augmented. Okay, let's go in the back. Oh wait, this isn't the back, is it? Ah, damn it. There might be an entrance through the... through the water, too. Maybe. But I really don't want to go in the water. I've only got six lockpicks. I don't want to use four of them. Alright, well, let me go into the building and see if there's another way up. Welcome to Queen's Tower. Party leader... Zan? Jean? I was much inspired by your speech to our local community. Use the residential directory computer, if you know how. You're gonna keep interrupting me, aren't you? I was much inspired by your speech to our local community resource center and wished to do my part in helping to maintain a free China. As you have said, there are many threats to that freedom both from within and without. It is with glad heart, then, that I am able to inform you of suspicious activities on the part of Dr. Tracy Feng. Dr. Feng has declared on a number of occasions that he believes cases of gray death are going untreated, a situation I cannot believe the party would permit, and has often observed leaving at odd hours on what he declares to be family emergencies. I believe that Dr. Feng is a good individual with the best hopes for Hong Kong and China at heart, and could thus benefit from counseling. Miss Chow was kind enough to bring this to my attention, and should be saluted for the many hours of entertainment and happiness she has brought to the Chinese people. The seventh floor is closed for renovations. You don't say. That makes me want to go there. There's got to be a secret way up to the seventh floor. I love the sound effects they have for all sorts of things. Like this security computer terminal, this super advanced piece of technology from the future. Amidst a horrible, ominous buzz. It's wow, wow. Like this would drive you nuts. Unlocked, and oh sweet, I opened the back door. No euphemism intended. Sweet. Somebody just left 50 credits on the table? Weird. Or keypad just like on the floor. Huh. Oh. What? Th this elevator is controlled by a keypad sitting diagonally on the corner of the elevator? What? So if you want to go up or down, you have to like bend down? <laughs> and put in the password into a thing on the ground? What? I don't get it. Ooh, what is that? Multi-tool. Got back my investment. A secret little compartment back there. Oh, 
Oh, is this her place? That's got to be her. Okay, well, I don't want to rudely drop in by raining glass upon her abode. So let's try to go in a different way. I'm really curious what's in here. It's got a strength of 60. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, I don't think that... Oh, shit. Did someone just see me? I think I made a mistake. <laughs> Let's not go. Oh my god, this is from where my save was. Paul Denton, I have the blueprints. Oh. Oh. I'll be back. Okay, let's try this again. By the way, I looked down here, which I didn't go to previously, and it turns out there's nothing down here. Yep. This place has very weird architecture. I really don't get it. Like, why does this space even exist? It seems totally pointless. Why do I hear someone running? Why do I hear running people? I hear people running. Is it because I jumped when I was on the elevator and someone heard it? Hmm. Well, whatever the case, I don't think they can get to me, so I don't think it matters. Okay, is there any way to go in without breaking the glass? Because that seems ridiculous. Surely she would hear that, right? <clears throat> I can open this, but they're probably going to see me. Plus, there's those alarm things that I can't disable from here. So, yeah. Hold on. I think maybe there's somewhere I can get off. You know, like right here. See, that was open for a second. Hmm. There's something I can do with that. Yes. Yes, there is. I don't know if I should have gotten off here, though. Hi. She's green. Okay, she doesn't care that I'm here. Excellent. What floor am I even on? Is this Maggie's place? I'm looking for Maggie Chow. You must be Mr. Denton. Miss Chow has been expecting you. She is waiting in the living room. Please follow me. Yeah, I think I'll come later. Oh shit. Oh god, they're enemies. What the fuck? Hello? Whoever's out there is in serious trouble. Is he actually gonna shoot me? He's showing up as red. That's the one. Okay, drop him. What? That makes no sense. Why would he shoot me? I didn't even go into like an unauthorized spot. I don't get it. That's really bizarre. if I go behind her and I introduce myself to Miss Chow without her even knowing that I'm coming. I do want to know what's in there. <laughs> so, let's find out. Oh my. 
She appears to have multi-million dollar, a uh, multi-million dollar laboratory in her building. Greetings, JC Dim. I have been observing you through this fascinating yeah, device in your skull. Yeah. You have found the proof we needed. The dragon's tooth sword. There, inside the glass case. If you wish to be my ally, you will retrieve the sword and await my instructions. If I wish to be his ally. That implies I actually don't have to get it. Maybe I could side with... Uh, with Maggie or something? But, I mean, my brother trusted Tracer Tong, right? So... They say the guy's got some new kind of implants. I think I'm going to side with Tracer Tong. I'm going to take it. Let's hope the camera doesn't see me. Ms. Chow, we are reassigning you temporarily. Put the long-term agenda on hold until Versa Life has met its deadline. It will be months and probably years before the Red Arrow can influence Beijing, whereas, well, I'm sure you heard about my appointment. We are in position to make a grab for Washington. We can't let this one slip through our fingers. Make sure the process stays on schedule. Well, I'm certainly not going to support her. Not if she's in bed with them. Pretty sure the camera would see me if I went over there. Check this. Please don't see me. Recording begins now. See, it's from MC. No, you took the sword. You and when I don't know how to pronounce that. You took it from the wrong place and the wrong people, and now you're in pain. You know how much I hate to see you in pain, baby. I am the dragon head of the red... Red Arrow Triad, and you are a hollow woman. I'm much more than that, Wen. I am the only thing standing between you and a world of hurt and darkness and shame. Tell me where the sword is, and maybe you'll die soon. And you, you, are a bad actress. Unknown sound? And you have one less finger. Oh my god. Recording ends. Okay, somebody's recording a torture session. Wonderful. It's delightful. Alright, let's see if I can read these. Reports, we have observed suspicious activity near the Luminous Path compound. Black helicopter and a foreigner asking a number of questions about the path and their leader. That'd be me. Okay. Alert. That's an alert about me existing. JC Denton. Mm-hmm. Try to... I don't have time to read that. Good. Now take the sword to Max Chin at the Lucky Money Club. If you can make peace among the triads, then perhaps I can help you in your difficulties. I'm gonna give it to somebody at the Lucky Money Club? It's a place that's full of slaves. Ah, oh well. If I've gotta do it, I've gotta do it. I don't really want to help anyone that's involved in the slave trade, but... Maybe I can cripple them at the same time. We'll see. I've got a bogey, no ID. Shit. Well, I'm fucked. That's him. <laughs> I could have maybe stopped him. I actually tried to probably should have tried to shock him. I might have been able to do it. I'm always amazed at how wide their field of vision is. It's always a little bit larger than I think. Ms. Chow, we are reassigning you temporarily. Alright, I suppose I could just run out there and grab the sword. I can actually read this one now. 
I've reviewed your latest report concerning the theft of the prototype sword and subsequent recovery efforts. You are to be commended for your swift response and exploitation of the theft to escalate tensions between the major, major triads. The resulting struggle will obviously weaken the native power structure, and I've already ordered an increased um, MJ-12 presence to, to be placed under your command for local operations. available in your notes the emails that you read, do you? I guess I would kind of totally get rid of the point of having, of getting more time when you upgrade your computer skill. You know, more time to read. That makes sense. Okay, well I was going in here to see if I could disable this damn camera so I can come out here comfortably to get it, but if they're just going to see me, I can't do that. I could put a distraction down, I suppose. I think I'm just gonna try to grab it. Hmm. Let's do it. Wait, does this camera not even care about me? <laughs> what? They're on the lookout for me specifically, and this camera doesn't even care that I'm here? Okay. The true weapon of a modern warrior. The dragon's tooth is not a sword in the traditional sense, but a nanotechnologically constructed blade that is dynamically forged on command into a non-eutatic solid. Nanoscale wedding device devices ensure that the blade is both unbreakable and lethally sharp. Can I use this? Oh my god. Holy shit, that's loud. This thing is pretty badass. It's a shame I play non-lethally because I'd like to chop up some people. Not to sound like a psychopath or anything. Is there any point in going to talk to... Going to talk to her at this point? I'm kind of curious. Hey. Where did that woman go? Wasn't she here? She was standing right here. Oh, there she is. Hmm. I'm looking for Maggie Chow. <laughs> you must be Mr. Denton. What? Ms. Chow has been expecting you. She is waiting in the living room. Please follow me. She just talked to me through a wall. Okay. Excuse me? Hello? I will accompany you. She's not here. What are you doing? The floor coverings were made by hand in Tibet. Okay, thank you for letting me know that. I don't really care. Where did she go? 